Actor Jake Abraham has died aged 56, just months after sharing a stark warning after leaving it too late to visit a doctor. The Lock Stock and Two Smoking Barrels star opened up about his cancer diagnosis only months ago, revealing that he had felt unwell for quite some time but had waited to get it checked out with the doctor. Jake continued to work until earlier this year, he was in pantomime The Scouse Jack and the Beanstalk at the Royal Court, which ran until January. In February, he visited the GP. Jake told the Liverpool Echo in July, I was working but I wasn't feeling well. I was pushing through those spells when you don't feel yourself, you haven't got the energy and there are aches and pains. The costume for the play was enormous, I knew I wasn't well then but had not been well for so long. What made me go to the doctor and get a PSA, prostate specific antigen? test was that I passed blood in my urine. I got a test and ended up in the royal. He said you've got cancer, I'm so, so sorry. He said that he'd had it for years, maybe four years. Jake was diagnosed with prostate cancer, which spread to the rest of his body and resulted in tumors on his spine and hips, and one removed from his bladder. He had been since receiving palliative care. He said at the time, doctors have told me it could be months, it could be years. It's frightening. It's scary, to be confronted with your own mortality is the most scary thing you will ever go through. To prepare for that and be cognitive mentally, but knowing that's what's coming, it's tough. Fans flock to X. Formerly Twitter, to pay tribute, with one writing, sad news tonight, hearing Liverpool actor Jake Abraham has passed away after his well-documented battle with cancer. Everyone knows him from Lockstock but there was so much more to Jake, from his at live every play youth performances to powerful at Channel 4 drama GBH. RIP. While another commented, so sad to hear of the passing of at Jake Abraham when one of LA test super talented actors Jake Abraham has passed away. For many of us growing up his humorous and deadpan acting style had us belly laughing. Deepest sympathy to all family and friends. A third wrote, such sad news today. Jake Abraham, one of the city's best loved actors, has died aged 56. Sending love to Jake's family, friends, and everyone at Royal Court Live, where he took to the stage many times. Speaking to the Echo in the summer, Jake had been keen to encourage people to take tests. There's currently no national screening program for prostate cancer in the UK, but a PSA test can find early signs of cancer and allow for earlier treatment. He said, I think most men take the approach of oh, he'll get on with it. Well I'm palliative now, I found out really late down the line and Terry's nothing they can do for me, I've just got it now and I've just got to wait for the day. But that could be avoided if you just get a PSA test. I know people might be waiting in a line and Terry's 18 in the queue, but just stick with the queue. Everyone else goes oh I'm not waiting, so you end up there with the appointment. Thinking ahead about the time he had left, the dad of two said that he just wanted to make some happy memories. All I want to do is the things I've always wanted to do, the bucket list, he said. I want to go to Italy to see the architecture and history in Rome. I want to be with my grandkids. My dad died not long before I got cancer. He died of a stroke. I never thought that this young, he'd be talking about cancer. But what it does do is give you a focus on how important now is, how important each second is and how precious it is. That's what it's given me. You look at the grandkids and realize, I'm just so lucky in that sense.
it gives you a perspective on that, I know I'm going to miss them. Jake also had a simple message for people, I was too late, please don't leave it too late. You could save yourself 10 or 20 years with your children and your family, and that's the most priceless thing you've got. Born in Toxteth, before growing up in Kensington, the 56-year-old actor began his career in the 1980s, among what he called a cauldron of talent at the Everyman Youth Theatre. Since then, he has enjoyed a four-decade career on stage and screen, touring with the National Theatre and working with some of the biggest names in British drama, including fellow Liverpudlian. However, he is probably best known for his role as Dean in gangster classic Lock, Stock and Two Smoking Barrels, Guy Ritchie's 1998 debut starring Jason Statham and Vinnie Jones. Jake leaves behind his wife, actress and singer Joanna Taylor, and their two children. R.I.P. Follow Mirror Celebs on Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube and Threads. Thank you.